because everybody Amen. ain't talking about a new house. Amen. See, that's what a, the, the devil always does that to you. He always isolates you. Amen. He's got to isolate you before he can kill you. You know that. Amen. See, see, if you study the, 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 the sheep and the shepherds, pastor, the lion and the bear, they don't run into the center of the pack. That's too hard. What they do is they study and they watch for that one that's lagging back a little bit. They watch for that little sheep that everybody's over to the right. they just a little bit too far over to the left. And when that sheep gets far enough away from the shepherd and the pack, he strikes. And that's when everybody turns around and says, what happened to Brother Jay? Oh, I thought he was here last week. No, that wasn't last week. He wasn't there. He, 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 he didn't come. Now you look up and it's been two, three, four weeks. And ain't nobody seen you. My God. Focus. Before you get mad at God for what he is not doing, praise him for what he is doing. This is my last statement. I was uh, reading some things and I had been praying. And I said, Lord, you know what? I was thinking about heaven and hell. How? Forever is a long time. Now that's good for those of us that are going to heaven. I already made my, my, my mind is made up. I'm not going to hell. It's, yeah, it's, that's why. It's absolutely <laughs> positively no reason to go. That's it. Amen. Absolutely no reason. You, you don't have to have cancer to know what kills. Do you? I know that's right. But I said to the Lord, I said, you know what, Lord? I, you know, how come you, you're not doing hell like the prison system? You know, you serve your time. You know, if you were a bad person here on earth, you know, why not you know, say, okay, you got to go for a thousand years. You go to hell for a thousand years and then you, you come to heaven. Yeah, I was, you know, negotiating with the Lord. Like, oh, you know, hell is, you know, when you think you got the murderers and the child molesters, worst the worst, yeah. you got the worst of worst in hell, and then you got the sister sitting in church that refused to give her time Jesus. in hell, the same hell yes. with the pedophiles. Jesus. You got the brother that talked about the pastor in the same hell as the drug dealer and the prostitute. That just seemed kind of harsh to me. I said, well, you know, how come you didn't send up like that? And he said to me, he said, let me ask you a question. I said, all right. I thought I had gone back, back to, to a corner. He said, what man that I have made has proven himself worthy to spend eternity with me in heaven? I said, excuse me? He said, what man is worthy to come to heaven with me? said, oh, you got it, Lord. You know what he was saying? None of us are worthy. But he's so good to us. When he could condemn us all to hell. And with good reason. The Bible says no good thing dwelleth in my flesh. Works can't get us into heaven. Because if works and money could get us there, the rich would get there and the poor would not. But what the Lord said to me is, 
instead of you trying to figure out how to get everybody out of hell, you ought to be thanking me that I have opened my heavenly doors so that you and all of you that will believe in me can come. Lift your hands, Father, we thank you now. Hallelujah. Father, while we're waiting for your word, waiting for your promises, help us to wait with patience, with joy. Help us to keep doing those things that you have commanded us to do. Lord, it doesn't matter who stopped doing it. It doesn't matter who stopped believing in God. Hallelujah. Help us, God, to stay focused to the mandate and to our calling. Oh, know that he that shall come will come and will not tarry. But that when you come, Lord, you have your reward with you and that you will pay every man according to our works. Hallelujah. Thank you now for this word. Encourage your people. Hallelujah. And whatsoever our hands find to do for the upbuilding of your kingdom, that we will do it. We thank you now in Jesus.